Revelation chapter 2, verse 2. And actually, let's start at Revelation uh, chapter 2, verse 1 and 2. So it says, Unto the angel of the church of Ephesus, or Ephesus, however you want to say it, write, These things saith he that holdeth the seven stars in his right hand, who walketh in the midst of the seventh, the seven golden candlesticks. So we know who this is right here. Uh, unto the angel of the church of Ephesus write these things, saith he that holdeth the seven stars in his right hand and walks in the midst of the seven golden candlesticks. This is our savior, Yahushua. So in verse two, what he says is this, I know thy works. So he's talking to the church of Ephesus. I know thy works and thy labor and thy patience, how and how thou canst not bear them which are evil. So now he's he's talking about somebody who's evil. And thou hast tried them which say they are apostles and are not, and hast found them liars. So here we see that there's apostles in Ephesus who are teaching the Ephesians. And they have tried and they can't stand the evil that they have taught and have found them liars. Now, I just wanted to point that out, that there were apostles there. So the first thing that I always think of, I'm like, man, so then were some of the 12 apostles, uh, you know, uh, 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 corrupt or anything like that? But I started searching, I searched the scriptures, I searched, I searched, I searched, I searched. And here's a fact. None of the 12 apostles went to uh, Ephesus that were ordained by Yahushua, the person you call Jesus, uh, including Matthias, who was chosen by the Holy Spirit through Peter and the other apostles. There were none. So there were none of the 12 apostles that's been recorded throughout the Bible that ever went to Ephesus or Ephesus. None of them. So I just wanted to point that out. So now what we have to do is we have to find out who were these apostles because remember there were uh, certain qualifications that had to be met in order to even be considered a candidate for apostleship. Most people don't even know that. That there were qualifications that you had to meet just to be a candidate for apostleship. 